Well, hi, Roy. Good evening. Brian Gallagos here from Salt Lake Valley Chevrolet. I just want to reach out and first of all say thank you for your recent inquiry on the Equinox. Uh, I just grabbed uh, the first set of keys that I found, to be totally honest with you, uh, since you didn't have any specifications and wanted to kind of walk around it a little bit, show you some of the features in here, and, and just kind of go from there. So this is the LS option. I do love this color, like absolutely adore this color. This is silver ice metallic. I own a Traverse in this color. Uh, it's one of my favorite things. But I wanted to flip around and start in the back here, okay? So we do have all of this storage space back here, all this like trunk space, so to speak. What's neat is additional storage space right here. And then underneath that is where the spare tire is gonna be. Cool, huh? And then uh, those seats do fold down. So we'll walk around to the back real quick and show you how that works. This is the LS. This is a 1.5 liter turbo. So this thing's got some vroom vroom. I love the two-tone cloth in this vehicle, like the, the gray and the black, just the two-tone all the way around it. I just think it's so neat. To pull this seat down, we just flip that little lever and these things lay fairly flat, which is super cool. If you got kids, I got air vents in the back. I got USB ports in the back. Like everybody can stay comfy, stay connected, all sorts of stuff. With this button right here, as long as the key fob's in your pocket or your purse, you just push that, door's gonna unlock, and we're gonna squeak ourselves right inside. Now let's go to some of the cool features in here. Now you do have the collision control with this with forward uh, assisted braking, forward automatic braking, excuse me, uh, which is super nice. So um, vehicle smart, right? We're driving along the road, somebody slams on their brakes in front of us. You don't notice the car's gonna alert you first, uh, and then it's gonna start to slow you down because it doesn't want to get into an accident. You know, I don't want you to get into an accident. I think that's a super neat safety feature. We've got the lane keep assist right here. So if we're going over the lines on the road without our blinker on, the car's gonna give us a little beep boop. It's gonna let us know, hey, you're going over the lines. Is this something you're intending to do? You know what I'm saying? And then using this directional pad right here, what I like is we got trip, right? Trip one, trip two. We've got fuel range. We can see our average vehicle speed. We can set a timer. Scroll over to vehicle, we got oil life, we got oil pressure, we've got tire pressure sensor, following distance, you can set the following distance in seconds that you want, which is super nice on this one. Check the coolant temp, uh, make sure the traction stability controls are on, things of that nature. And then we go into the eco mode, it's gonna show us over the last 30 miles how many average uh, MPGs we're getting, pretty neat. Over here, we do have this uh, infotainment center, uh, this little touch screen. So we're gonna be able to pair our phone via Bluetooth, uh, make some hands-free calls right here, okay? We're also gonna be able to, with the audio settings, listen to our phone if we got spent. The Spotify's or the Pandora's or the Apple CarPlay's or the, or the not the Apple CarPlay, what's the word I'm looking for? Google Play Store, that's the one, um, or uh, Apple Music. We do have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, but the way that those work is you plug your phone into the USB port right there, and that's gonna turn into a second phone screen for us. We're gonna have access to a lot of uh, different applications uh, as we're driving down the road, which is also very nice, very convenient. Okay, now we're gonna get a, a free trial of uh, OnStar with this, and with OnStar, you're gonna get Wi-Fi in the car. Your car is going to be a Wi-Fi hotspot. How cool is that? So you can stay connected, uh, stay stay in touch, stay on the socials, stay on the snaps. Hopefully you're not snapping while you're driving, but as soon as you park, you can get up to 50 feet away, stay connected to the vehicle. Super cool. Got the all-wheel drive option right there. What I love about the all-wheel drive on this vehicle is if you're going 45 miles an hour, it starts to get a little slick, push the button. You're going 55 miles an hour, it gets a little slick, push the button. Whenever you feel like you need it, push the button. It's so awesome. It just engages automatically. You don't have to stop, put it into park, all of that stuff. Anyways, Roy, I could talk about this Equinox for days. Well, not literal days, but you understand what I'm saying. I'd love to invite you down to the dealership. Uh, take a look with me. I've got a ton of inventory, all sorts of different colors and trim levels and engine sizes. And uh, Give me a call. Let's set up an appointment. Let's get you down here. Let's take a look, see what your needs are, what your wants are, and go from there. Again, Roy, this is Brian. Salt Lake Valley Chevrolet. Hey, I appreciate your time. Look forward to hearing from you and working with you real soon.